also switch box. You want to make sure you identify your wires. Um, make sure you know which wire is which. So I got my power in, my power out, and my switch lights in the middle. So these wires do make a difference. For the plugs, they all, for the plugs they just all go together, but for the switches, there's a different setup, so you need to know which is which. Once again, I'm just going to ground the box real quick and then get these first wires out of the way. So much noise, I'm sorry. So I'm just going to untwist these. That way I can get the grounds all the way to the back. Take my longest wire, ground it real quick. Let me just get a screw out of my pocket. Once again, this is commercial application. So I'll try to do like a different video with plastic from Xboxes and stuff like that later, but um, I will just strip this. Luckily this one is working. Sometimes they don't really work that well. And once again, you can't really see it, but I'll show you at the end. I'm just gonna wrap this around the screw. To work with the camera out of my way, so wrapping this around the screw, you can kind of see it. Don't have my screw gun on the right tip right now, so I'm just going to do this again. Tighten this down with the flat blade. Push these to the left corner, then I'm going to pigtail these. Just cut these at four finger lengths. Cut the, cut, the end, cut the end of these straight. That finger really hurts. Sometimes you'll get these cut at a bad angle and then I'll make for a bad connection or it'll start to fall out of the wire nut. So just make sure the ends of these are flat. And then grab a wire nut. Put that in my gun. Line all these up. The more of these you get, like once you get like five, seven, Five, six, seven. Of them. It gets really annoying. Get to use a bigger wire nut and stuff like that. But just make sure they're not gonna fall out. Pull on them. That's the way I do it. You don't have to, but just make sure. Just a safety way to make sure that the wires aren't gonna fall out. So once you make up your grounds, all the neutrals tie together. In this case, and they, they won't be pigtailed. If you're in a different application, like a bathroom or something, and you needed a neutral for like one of the new types of switches, and then you could pigtail one of them or whatever. But I mean, you can pigtail it and then just cap it off, but you don't need to in this application because uh, we're just doing regular switches, I think. So I'm just gonna tie these together real quick. Line these up again. Pull on them again. Make sure nothing's gonna come out. Line those up. And then you're gonna wanna make sure your switch leg is not tied in with the power, otherwise the light will always be on until you fix it. So I got my two power wires here, my power out and my power in. Switch leg is right there. I'm gonna keep that out of the way. So I'm gonna tie the powers together. So when you put the switch in, it only... When you put the switch in, it only has two screws. Um, one of them is for power, one of them is for the switch leg. So you need to take the two power wires down to one. You can bring your switch leg down. Let's push these both in the corner here. Hold the lights up. So 
Time together, like wrap it around each other, and stuff them in there. I don't have a mud ring on me right now, so this is what it looks like without a mud ring. And then we'll just stay like that, which looks pretty decent. And as you can see, I got the ground screw in the back right there, and that's what it looks like, guys. So you need a ground and two blacks, one hot, one switch leg. That's what it looks like. All right, guys, uh, hopefully you enjoyed the video and found it beneficial. If there's anything I skipped over or went over too fast, drop me a comment down below and I'll clarify that for you. Um, but I uh, hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for stopping by. I appreciate it. God bless. Have an awesome rest of your day. If you, if you, I don't know if I said this already, but if you enjoyed it, give it a like and subscribe uh, for more videos like this. Or if you got any other videos you want to see, drop a comment down below and I will get to it and uh, I'll try to tag you or somehow um, make that for you. So, all right guys, see you later. Thanks for watching. Peace out.